So first we're going to integrate this function. So remember that the integral of a times x to the power of n dx is a times x to the power of n plus 1 divided by n plus 1. So here when we are integrating 4x to the power of 3, that's going to become 4x to the power of 4 divided by 4 plus now integral of this will be 6x to the power of 3 divided by 3. Now this 4 and 4 will cancel and 6 divided by 3 gives us 2. Now the next thing we want to do is find x to the power of 4 plus 2x to the power of 3 and we want to find that between 4 and 1 because that's what our limits are. So that's going to be, so we're going to sub in 4 first into wherever we see the x. So that's going to be 4 to the power of 4 plus 2 times 4 to the power of 3. And remember to put a bracket around this before we minus our f of 1. So we have essentially, this is our f of 4. And now we're minusing f of 1 from that. So we're going to sub in 1 everywhere you see x. So this is going to be, again, put a bracket, 1 to the power of 4 plus 2 times 1 to the power of 3. So let's simplify that now. So 4 to the power of 4 is going to be 256 plus 2 times 4 to the power of 3 is going to be 128 minus 1 to the power of 4 is 1 plus 2. So that's going to be 256 plus 128, 384. And then we're minusing 3 from that. So that's going to be 381. 